and then we'll literally just suction from the buckle a little bit. We'll literally just go in all the way to complete depth. You can see how I'm burying it all the way. I won't go too deep. And I do a couple of pumps and then pop out. The next handle says 3.0C with handle number two. So I'm going to bring in handle number two. There's the 3.0 end. It's going to go into the master cylinder. We've got it placed completely and we have a 3.0C drill and we'll literally place it all the way in to depth and bury it a few times and we're done with that. Now in this particular situation, according to our plan and according to what we know, um, the actual osteotomy is done. So if you notice, there's only two, two drills to use. So I take the surgical guide out and I just flush to make sure I remove any bone chips and any tissue issues. Okay, now again, as I mentioned earlier, true guided surgery involves placing the implant directly through the guide. So we're going to place our guide back in. In this particular case, we're going to use a Biomet 3i 4x13 implant. We just gently open this and there you can see the implant and the cover screw.